Good evening and welcome. Uh, as AJ said, this is our 19th year of being a part of the Comerica Java and Jazz Concert Series. And we are so proud to be a part of this and for it to last for 19 years. You know, not much lasts that long anymore. So, <laughs> so on behalf of all of my colleagues that I see scattered around here, I just want to say welcome. Thank you. Comerica has been in the community for 170 years, and this is a part of our ongoing commitment to the community. And we just feel it's so important to continue with this tradition and bring world-class artists to the community free of charge. And so you can sit back and... Yes, thank you. And our great partner, Frida Sampson, in the back. Wave your hand, Frida who has provided the coffee and refreshments for us for all 19 years. So that's a great partnership as well. So I just want to again say... <laughs> so again, thank you for being here. I hope to see you every month from now through July. We're going to have some great artists between now and then. And um, welcome this evening, and again, uh, enjoy. Thank you, Patricia. We have a lot going on at the Detroit Public Library. A lot of things happening. We want to make sure that you know what's, what's going on and that you take all the materials that we have on this table to the right when you come out, share with all your friends. Um, we don't want anything left after this concert series, okay? The materials are for you to take and share. One thing I wanted to highlight is our 2019 African American book list. This is a book list that we've been doing for decades, many decades. Um, it's something that I think each one of you will find very important and very special. Highlights African-American uh, authors, uh, their books, topics. And this season, uh, the topic is Inventing Lines, Black Women Writing Our Story. We have plenty of these as well. Please pick up a copy, pick up two and take it with you on your way out. Lastly, how did you guys hear about this? Website, website. Email, email. Okay, uh, social media, Facebook, Twitter maybe? Word of mouth, that, there it is, okay. Just wanted to do real scientific right there, right? Just wanted to see how things were happening. So. We're going to get this started now. Um, please, again, find a seat. Find a seat. The lights will be coming, coming down shortly. And I am going to bring to the stage, I'm going to welcome the internationally known, Detroit's own, Miss Kimmy Horn. Good evening. Baby, I can't live to love you as long as I want to. Life isn't long enough, baby. I can love you as long as I live. Baby, I can buy you diamonds and things like I want to. I can promise you, baby, I'm gonna want you as long as I live. I never care, but now I'm scared I won't live long enough. That's why I wear my rubbers when it rains And eat an apple every day and see the doctor in the way And what if I can't live to love you as long as I want to Life is long enough, baby Yeah, they ain't a little I'm out Mr. Chris Cornish, ladies and gentlemen, on piano
I can live to love you as long as I want to. Life is long enough, baby. I can love you as long as I live. Baby, I can buy you diamonds and things like I want to. I can promise you, baby, I'm gonna love you as long as I live. I never cared, but now I'm scared. I won't live long enough. That's why I went my I am super excited tonight. I'm telling you, I was so, so excited because I have never performed at the Detroit Main Library. So this is um, the first time for me. As soon as he called me, it's like, oh, I'm so there. I am so there. I haven't even had my cup of coffee yet, but I'm getting my Java too. As a native Detroiter, it's an honor. What can be better than this? Right in the heart of the city. Right in the heart of the city. Right in the heart of the city, in the city, 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 city. What can be better than that? What can be better? I don't think nothing right now. See? Better sailing at midnight. Better than diving for pearls. Better than skiing in the Aston. Better than feeding the squirrels. Better than finding a horseshoe. Better than losing your head. Better than anything you ever thought of. And better than anything you ever said. Better than singing right aloud. Humping and caught up in a crowd. Better than anything it's just being in love. Being in love. Better than poor. Sets of easy and better to go face his band and better to Rollins and Coltrane and Monk on the stand. Better than L. Love is jail, old Miles' latest news. Better than the whole heaven's ballads, better than Joe Williams' blues. Better than hearing Lady Day or checking in at the grave. Better than anything except being in love. Nothing like being in love.
Better than peanuts and popcorn and French lemonade. Better than miles on the midway. Better than seals blowing horns. Better than mere shot from cannon. Better than fresh ears of corn. Better than singing right aloud. Or being caught up in a crowd. Better than being in love. Well, better than hearing Lady Day. Checking it out. Better than being in love or having someone to love you back, love you back. Hey, oh, Jason, madam, hey, 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 Mr. Pena Smith on bass guitar, Jeff Kennedy on drums, and Mr. Chris Kodish on piano, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh, it's hot in here. Not literally, but figuratively. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 
How many men I can, can relate to that? Just give her what she wants. Because the, truthfully, I'm telling you, because if she is happy, then everybody's happy. If your home is happy because of her, then everyone is happy. Yeah. Give her what she wants. Give her what she wants, Lola. You give her what she wants. She wants. She wants. She wants. slow it down a little bit tonight because it truly was a perfect day. It just was. The sun was shining. The breeze was just right. But we can stand a little bit to be a little hotter. Now I'm grateful now. Don't get me wrong. We don't have no snowstorm out there. Let me talk. Not talk not, let me not talk too loud though. <laughs> It's such a perfect night, and it's so, so good to see so many familiar faces out here in the front. But it's a lot of new faces here, too. How many of you here, like I, is visiting for the very first time? Wow. 
we welcome us. <laughs> yeah, such a perfect night. I found a love for me, darling. Just dive right in and follow. My lead, but I found a love beautiful and sweet. I never knew you were that someone waiting for me, but we were just kids when we. Not knowing what it was, I would not give you love this time. But darling, just kiss me so alone. I know that all I own in your arms.
the mess. See, now I know I have been an angel in person, and he loves her hands. I don't deserve this, baby. You look, you look perfect. This is a great, great song. I, um, I truly, truly love this song. I heard it many, many years ago and really didn't understand what, what it was really talking about, but I matured and the lyrics somehow met up with me. <laughs> but it's a great, great song and of course, our dear friend and pianist extraordinaire and musical director, Mr. Al McKenzie with this amazing arrangement. Come on, give it up for Mr. Al McKenzie. And we all, may we all continue to pray and give him our support. But this particular song is a song that he just put his stamp on. Yes, and we're going to share that with you tonight. A song entitled, Tennessee Waltz. Dancing with my darling to the Tennessee walls. Then an old friend I happen to see. I introduced her to my darling, and while they were dancing, my friend stole my sweet heart from me. I remember the night in the Tennessee walls. Now I know just how much I have lost. Oh, I lost my pretty darling. The night they were dancing, that beautiful Tennessee walls. Chris Cotish on piano. I lost my, my pretty darling 
Don't even try it, Jeff. You're not getting ready to get me to do all that. You're not going to do it. All right, all right. Not going to get me to do it. We'll do this instead. How about that? Just a little bit, fellas. You know, I'm so excited to share about so many wonderful things that are going on. I was able to launch my jazz festival, my own Kimmy Horn Jazz Festival in 2016. I had no idea what I was doing. I just knew that after 30 years of traveling all around the world, and meeting and connecting with so many of my musical peers, especially native Detroiters. I mean, literally, we will be at the airport. One of us is coming in. I'm coming into Japan. They're leaving out to Australia. I mean, we're passing each other in a way. And it's a great thing because it's wonderful to be able to connect. But after so much traveling and as you, again, begin to mature, you know, you just start to think about, you know, there are some people I just want to perform with. There are some people, some musicians, some singers that we're always working all the time. I say, like, I just have to create a stage where we all can come together and have a good time. And I branded it as a musical family affair. Because these guys, ladies and gentlemen, we're family. These are my brothers up here. So after 2016 launching the festival in Lathrop Village, small, quaint, yes, small, small, quaint, charming village, in 2016 and 17. And then I started to notice that the crowds were just getting bigger and bigger. It's a free outdoor festival. It truly is something amazing. 10 amazing performers. You know, we raise funds and give it back to charities. The last two years, it was Ronald McDonald House that I am so proud to say we have contributed and donated over $10,000 to the Ronald McDonald House charity. The other thing that I truly, truly wanted to be able to do is to have a Lifetime Achievement Award to honor I'm talking about legendary performers that may not have been recognized, or they may have been recognized, but something that they have always touched my heart with. The first year was James Cohen, pianist extraordinaire. That's right, extraordinary. The second year was saxophone extraordinaire, Larry Smith. Yes. And last year was really, really special because it was the first vocalist to receive the Lifetime Achievement Award for the Kimmy Horn Jazz Festival. And that was the one and only Miss Ursula Walker. So I say all of this to say, save the date, August the 9th and 10th, in the city of Southfield, right there in front of the library. We want you to all come out, bring your lawn chairs, bring your family and come for a good time because we have a good time. That's what it's all about. Sending this out to you, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, do, 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 As around the sun, the earth, no, she's revolving. 
And the rosebuds are blooming in early May Just as honest born is new You know what I say is true That I'll be loving you always Yes, now I know I'm living but tomorrow But in passing we'll grow older every day Trust is hate, no love to cure You can rest your mind assured and that I'll be loving you all the way Through the rain, through the stars out in the sky Until the orphans come in bed and wait and hide Until the dolphins fly and parents live at sea Until the dream of life and life becomes a dream oh, Did you know that you love us for nothing? Another day, just as now time to move on since the beginning. Seasons know exactly when to change. Just as kind as no no shame. Know through all your joy and pain that I'll be loving you always. Now I know. I'm not 
here, Tracy Wyatt. I'm sure some of you folks know Tracy Wyatt. She does a lot in behind the scenes for this. But what I wanted to do was to actually acknowledge her mother, who has been attending these events with her throughout the years. And tomorrow is her 80th birthday. So we would like to say happy birthday to Mother Wyatt. Folks, thank you. So you're also probably wondering why we have these folks, this young man right here, running around all over the place, all on the stage. We are filming this event, okay? What we would, and um, people have been asking, well, where can we see it? Where can we see it? So, who's familiar with YouTube? <laughs> all right. So the Detroit Public Library has a YouTube channel, and this will be on the YouTube channel in roughly two weeks. So check back, we'll have some information on our website. Go to the website, we'll be able to link you to it. And um, you'll be able to enjoy it all over again. All right. So, once again, welcome the internationally known Detroit's own, Kimmy Horn. Truth about my chances, being 
just when you think that I opened the door, you closed it just in time. You're going back in bed, and it's hard to pin you down. There's a chance that in the Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Are you guys having a good time? I know I am. I'm having too much fun. I was back in the green room and just talking, talking, talking. Then I said, wait, this is the second show. Hold on. But it's all good. It's truly, truly all good. Especially with the celebrating a great, great month like this month. Women's History Month. So I like to channel and do a tribute to a legend, a movie icon, an amazing singer, an activist, and my great, great aunt the one and only Miss Lena Horn. Don't know why There's no sun up in the sky Stormy weather Since my man It's raining all the time Life is real Gloom and misery everywhere Stormy weather Can't keep my poor sail
since he went away, the blues walked in and met me. If he stays away, rocking chair will get me. All I do is pray that the Lord above will let me walk in the sun once more. Yeah, yeah, go on. Everything I have is gone. Stormy weather. Keep my full sail together. I will really all the time. All the In honor of a legend. <laughs> In honor of a legend, Thaddeus Walker. See what Lena gave me extra strength. I tore the microphone stand right out of the. I can't help it sometimes, ladies and gentlemen. It's the things that happen on stage live. See, I used to be a major rat. But this song right here, ladies and gentlemen, I want to take you back to, I, I'm talking about some good old home-fashioned days. I'm talking about the time when, see, I was brought up in a very, very musical family, right? I'm talking about my dad was a musician, an amazing drummer, a great singer. My uncle was a member of the Fantastic Four. You remember that group? One of Motown's earlier groups. Cleveland Horn, that's my uncle. And I can't leave 
my oldest brother out, Mr. Tony Horn, who's with me here tonight and every time I'm on stage. My oldest brother, so. See, we grew up on great, great songs and great, great artists. Now, by a round of applause, I'm talking about great artists like Nat King Cole. Smooth, right? But wait a minute. What about that soulful Donny Hathaway? But truly, truly, nobody could touch. Absolutely nobody. My uncle Wayne and my dad will be standing over me like, you know, learn this song, learn this song. Get the tones, do this. Sam Cook. I'm talking about good old home fashion music, right? So, right, it just touches the soul. So, little did I know, here I am traveling. Every year for the last 21 years, I've had the great pleasure of going over and perform in Japan. So every year I go there, especially the first year, I got so homesick. See, because it's just me, and the whole orchestra was Japanese. It was a Japanese orchestra. Even on the plane on that 16-hour ride, I'm thinking, why did I take this gig again? I can't speak Japanese, and they can't speak English. But I went over there on a prayer, and I went over there with faith. And I had to go. As a singer, I had to go. So I get there, and it immediately, as soon as I met the orchestra, again, we're rehearsal, and I'm like, hey. oh, hi, hi, hi. And all they knew is my spirit was real, and their spirit was real. So as soon as we started playing together, that's when I learned that music transcends race, demographics, languages, cultures. It truly does. So I'm here, and I'm getting homesick still one night. And then I learned that, wow, their song has the same melody as a good old home-fashioned song for me. So I said, I'm going to learn this song in Japanese and sing it. So is it okay if I share it with you right here tonight? <laughs> Thaddeus Walker, my brother, where are you? Let me see, I'm gonna use my other strength then. So I won't trip. So, this is what I do when I go up to the Japanese party. It's really some, something like this, nice and intimate. I would go up and I would say, Watashi wa Kimi-san. And then I would proceed to start singing like this. It goes like this. Don't know much in my you came by. Kimi ni ae no galo wo. Don't know much in my you came by. Now, Kimi ni ae no galo wo. But all she had te o kude yo. But I'm in the city right now. So I know Detroit. I know you know this song. Damn, I'm just gonna move this over here just for now. Here we go, it goes like this. Here we go now. Now don't know much about history. There you go. Don't know much of biology. Don't know much about science books. You know it then. I don't know much about the bridge I took. Well, and but I do know that I love you. And I know that if you love me too, what a wonderful world this would be. I don't know much about geography. I don't know much of trigonometry, and I don't know much about algebra. I don't know what a side rule I'm for. But I do know what I want is to. And if this world would be with you, what a wonderful world this would be. Now, I don't claim huh, to be this A student. Maybe by being in nature. 
my oldest brother, Mr. Tony Horn, ladies and gentlemen. We are gonna continue to sound the horn for our legacy.
my oldest brother, ladies and gentlemen, Tony Horn. Miss Kimmy Horn, ladies and gentlemen, my sister. <laughs> yeah. We just sound in the horn, that's all. Yes. We're gonna really slow it down now. This um this amazing, amazing song. I, I'll never forget, you know, when you have singers in the family, you have to sing at every event, okay? <laughs> Weddings, anniversaries, funerals. And don't you even think about asking for no money. <laughs> oh, <that's right. laughs> They'll feed us, though. But it's all good, because we got a call to go to Chicago to do a, a, a wedding for my cousin. And, and I had never heard this song. Tony, have you ever heard the song? Never, never. We had never heard the song. But as soon as we heard these lyrics, it's like, oh my gosh. This is one of the most beautiful songs that we ever heard. And to harmonize on it, it just was a beautiful, beautiful song. So I like to um, do this song, and I always say this because as soon as I heard it, the lyrics of the song, it, it reminded me immediately of, of Miss Gretchen. That's the owner of the Dirty Dog Jazz Cafe. Yes, and I thought about her when I heard the song is because when I launched my jazz festival in 2016, and like I said, I didn't know what I was doing. So I arranged to meet with her and we sat down and the first thing she told me, she said, Kimmy, it's a lot of work. And when she said that, it truly stirred up my soul because it's like, I just looked at her and I said, but I'm up for the challenge. And again, we have received now over 15,000 people at our last jazz festival. So I thank you, Miss G. And for believing in me, and she was the first sponsor to donate to the jazz festival. So she didn't just talk. She actually said, here, baby. Go and fly. So this is a song I think of. The day we met, rose in I held my breath. Right from the start, I knew that I found that home for my heart. Beats fast and colors of promise. How to be brave and how do I love when I am afraid to fall? But watching you stand alone and all of my doubt suddenly went away. Some Wait. 
Mr. Tony Horn. Miss Kimmy Horn, ladies and gentlemen. See what I mean? Isn't that a beautiful song? <laughs> Before we go into this next song, I just want to make this a thank you, Thad. Come on, give it up for Thaddeus Walker right here. That's why right. you are working today, aren't you? Yes, please, please, thank you. Mm -hmm. So um, I, I'm so, ex I already said I'm excited, but I am truly excited because not only am I debuting, and this is my first time here, I have just signed on to be one of the um, celebrity dancers for Motor City Dancing with the Stars. Yes. But hold up, it's not the TV one, okay? I know, I just calm down. But it's still a good thing because I'm <laughs> I know she was like, TV? This is like TV. It really is. An audience is an audience, right? But anyway, this is going to be at the MGM Grand Casino in the, in the Grand Ballroom, and it is for um, the Deltas, their 80th anniversary. And so, oh, we have some Detroit Delta chapter here. So, yes. So, I am so excited to be chosen as one of the dancers. So, I'm telling you, I took a month off January. I was like working on my dance steps. I told him, you, don't, you can't lift me, but I can hang with any step that you throw at me. <laughs> but it's going to be a lot of, lot of fun. It's actually April, to, April the 13th. So please, yes, tickets are available. Please purchase your tickets because you're going to say, get me on after that. <laughs> it doesn't even matter if I win or not. But I did tell my instructor I'm looking to win. <laughs> and she's showing me love. So in honor, too, of um, Women's History Month, who better than tribute, do a tribute to right now is Phyllis Hyman. Come on, Detroit. From measure to measure, your love so much pleasure Like a haunting melody Came inside and captured me Now I am so happy You're the rhythm of my rhyme You and I together 
Oh, oh, but you wanted to get up. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Get on up here. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Get on up here. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. She danced longer than you did. Come on. You know how to love me. He's ready right here. Come on, let this man out. You he know about how to make it right. He's let him out. You let him out. I can tell. I can. No, no, you come up here with me. Come on, come on. Ooh. You know how to love me. Oh, you feel it, ain't you? You know how to Ooh, watch your step. Are you scared you're gonna hit me, right? Come on, come on. Ooh, you know how. You know how to love me. You do know how to love me. You know how to love me. Say what? You know how to love me. Hey, 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 now. Nah. You know how to love me. What about this to say? Thank you. 